Hey guys, welcome back to my video. My name is Kayla. And if you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe, turn on those post notifications if you haven't done so already. So I'm going to tell you guys about my shunt revision surgery. Let's get on with the video. Hey guys, um, I'm going to tell you guys about my shunt revision surgery. So I got surgery on Wednesday the 20th. I think so what happened was is I went to my doctor's appointment I had two I had one so they could do like a MRI and so they had like draw my blood they couldn't they drew my blood but they couldn't find a vein on both arms so anyways as soon as I got done with that I went to my my appointment with my doctor Dr. Zachary, we went in and he told us everything. Well, then he told us saying that I had to get surgery right away. That we couldn't wait. We couldn't do anything. We had to get this done now. So me and my dad decided to go get my COVID test. We went there. Everything was fine. We come back home. Everything's fine. Until the next day. My dad gets a call from ProMedica saying that, or the ProMedica Urgent Care saying that I tested positive for COVID-19. Which, I think it's because I've had a cold and I think that's why, but I don't know. And I told my dad, I was like, am I still having surgery? Am I, you know, still having that? He's like, uh, we'll see. I'm like, well, then... I knew we were still going to have a surgery because my doctor said that it was an emergency surgery. So then we left at like 1130. We got to the hospital. We went to the um, recovery thing, you know, to get ready. And we waited for over maybe like a four to six hour wait. Dr. Zachary got done with his surgery. I went in, I didn't remember anything except they went in, when I went into the surgery room, they put like this thing in my arm and it stained and it burned so bad. And so then I went to recovery. I was so out of it because all the, you know, anesthesia and all that stuff. And my head hurt so bad because of what they did. And so they took me to my room, of course, took me to my own room. And my mom and my dad came um, to my room. It was about like 11 or so. And so we, um, they left. I could not sleep at all that night because of doctors coming in and all of that stuff. And I couldn't, I couldn't sleep. So the next day, I had a major headache, like major, major, major headache. And yeah, so about like noon, that was the time that we left. We went home, we were driving home and all that stuff. And I came home and, you know, Everything was fine, you know, every, the doctor said, and we had a follow-up that day. He took out my stitches, and Dr. Zachary said that everything was okay, and that I can go back to school that Thursday. And, you know, I was glad that everything went okay, because, you know, if something didn't happen, and we, if this wasn't, you know, something that didn't happen, you know, something could have happened, you know, but at least I'm so glad for my doctors and I'm so glad they did everything they could, everything they did that they had to do. And I'm so glad for my parents, you know, being there and being on my side, especially when I got home. Even George being on my side. You know, my brother, 
even though he didn't really take care of me. Um, so yeah, that's all about how I got my surgery and how it went. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. If you did so, please like this video. Give this a big thumbs up. Put on, turn on those post notifications if you haven't done so. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Because you need to. Alright? Bye, guys.